Good evening. We're back with more Marvel Snap. Beginning the evening at rank 70 and 4 cubes. We're in a new season, May 2023. I spent the early part of the season messing around with different decks. And now we're going to play, this evening we're going to play Mr. Negative with Valkyrie, Knoll, Mighty Thor, Bast, and Leader, and we'll see how it goes. I don't think I want to Bast yet. I don't know if this is going to be a Mr. Negative Mighty Thor game or not. Don't know why my opponent is snapping on that. Figures Mysterio is good for him. Go ahead and play Bast here. It doesn't look like a Mr. Negative game. So one in seven chance of drawing him. Okay, it's Patriot. Patriot with Iron Man, interesting. Is this enough to win? Mystique is worth nine here. Doesn't seem like it's enough to win. Seems like I may have overcommitted to Weird World. If I drew my Iron Man, I would have won. Valkyrie might have won? Uh, maybe not. We got Mr. Negative, but not a good draw to go with it. Used to be Rocket Raccoon was always a bot, but now with Nebula, not the case anymore. We'll play Bast here. Oh, it, this is a bot. That's a really bad card for the bot. Bot really wants Death's Domain.
Do I want to do I have a better chance of beating the bot at Shuri's lab or just at Bifrost? I think it's just Bifrost. Hopefully it's not a retreating bot. Okay. I, I still play Bast. I don't see myself playing Nimrod, so... I mean, I could with Zola, but... Oh, I should have played Bast to the Nebula site. That was silly. Am I playing Galactus? He's got Nimrod? It probably is Galactus. If it isn't, I think I'm in pretty good shape. He doesn't have a way to play Galactus early, at least. Oh, I should have just played Darkhawk to Asteroid M. Wow, I'm playing poorly. He's setting up the Galactus play, most likely. I'm not sure I can actually do anything about it. Oh yeah, I can. Yep. I don't think he would have called a snap there. If he had played Wolverine left, he might have had a chance to... No, he would have gotten more power, but he wouldn't have had a chance to win. Nebula is a really good card. Best battle pass card that's come along in a while. fits into nearly every deck. We got the negative Jane Foster combo and none of the zero cost cards in hand or the zero power cards in hand yet. That's a really good start. We know Leech and Sandman are mostly gone from the meta. All that's really left is Wave. A lot of these Thanos decks do run or Wave though, so I don't know if I can snap really on this.
Yeah, he's running the death version, so he's absolutely running wave. Unfortunately, I drew Iron Man, but I can still draw Mystique, Darkhawk, Knoll, Zola. Some combination of those cards. Just don't want to see Wave on 5. Unfortunate to draw Bast there. I would have preferred to draw one of the zero cost cards so I could play it right away so I could draw more cards, but didn't work out that way. Okay, he didn't have wave. Why is this minus six? Wait, what? Why is this minus six here? Was minus six power destroyed? Oh, I think that was the case. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, I will just go... I think that's fine. Play Null just to get uh, just to get more power on uh, Bishop. Yeah, there's no way he's gonna call there without wave unless it was a bot. But bots don't play Thanos. Still, I think it's usually worth doing the. Uh, what they call the boomer snap there because it does get called a surprising amount of the time I realized that while I was playing Kang people don't want to back away from stuff and sometimes you're facing a bot and you don't know it so if you think you're gonna win I think it's good to snap no matter what turn it's on Mr. Negative. Not likely to get a good draw here. I could get Bishop, Zola, Valkyrie. Mighty Thor would be terrible. Bast would be meh. Bishop. This may be a bot I'm facing. The Wolf Spain play. Yeah, this could be a bot. I think I do go with Iron Man here. Could just be a Mr. Negative deck that didn't draw Mr. Negative, but I don't know why you would play Wolf's Pain. There is Zola, so I can go Steak, Zola. It'll boost me to 14 there. Is that my best play? Or is it something clever like Leader Zola? We could try that. It's funny at least.
<laughs> okay, worked out. I think it was probably a bot. I don't know why you would ignore Baxter building. Yeah. So we're climbing at a rapid late rate because facing a lot of bots. And from what I've seen from other players this season, they all are saying the same thing. They're facing a lot of bots. I don't know why. Maybe matchmaking's been changed. Maybe I've got infinite MMR because I ended last season at Infinite and maybe they maybe when they made it so that Infinite players only play other Infinite players they also made it so Infinite MMR players only play against others and if there aren't many on then it's bots I don't know maybe they want people playing a lot of bots too so that everybody climbs to Infinite no idea but it seemed like a lot of bots. They actually just play bass to murder world here. Destroys my mighty Thor, but it buffs the Iron Man, the Zola. In this round we can play Iron Man. Ooh. Now I have the negative mighty Thor combo. I still have Darkhawk and Null in my deck. I think I will do that. Even though Mighty Thor is 3 power here. I'll draw Noel, Darkhawk, and then either Valkyrie or Leader. Should be pretty good. But it's a Miracle Sarah deck. No obvious targets for him to counter, though. And he has initiative, which is something a Miracle Sarah deck really doesn't want. He's got three cards in hand. Once again, a game where negative power was destroyed. Uh, so we do something like... Dark Hawk. Mystique. Null Leader. Dark Hawk. Maybe it's just something like that. Is that good enough to snap on? I think so. I'm adding 12 power to Shadowland plus whatever his most powerful card is there. Nerfs his Lizard by 4. We've got Darkhawk, Mystique, Knoll, yeah.
Oh. Bast, where are you? Okay, well I can go... Do I want to do that? How big is this card going to be? He's probably playing the Infinite deck. I'd go 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 20 to his 3, 6. Hmm. Maybe it's safer to go for something else. Do this. I am Iron Man. I am Iron Man. Was infinite. So I was correct not to play to the vault. I think Mr. Negative is probably the bit in the best spot that it's been in for a long time because it hated Leech, hated Sandman. And we're seeing less wave now, which is good. I was seeing a lot of wave early in the season when I was messing around with different decks. Well, I guess I'll play Bast here since it doesn't look like I have Mr. Negative. Or I'm going to have Mr. Negative. It's pretty unlikely to draw it. And I'm conceding Shuri's Lab because my deck isn't that good against it. Although I could Valkyrie it later. If I draw Valkyrie. This draw is epically bad. I don't think I'm going to win this one. Huh? What if I Valkyrie and then Zola the Valkyrie? an idea. I don't know if it's a good idea.
No, you want to solo the Valkyrie first. Because then that will buff the Angela. Let's do this for science. Doesn't work if he plays anything else to Shuri's lab. I don't think. Actually, the interaction with Bishop is kind of weird, so it might. Looks like it's going to work. Oh, what? Oh, I forgot about Nebula. No. So I actually needed to play the rock to Shuri's lab and I would have won. Aw. That's so sad. No tokens means no thank you. No reason to play Bast yet since I don't have a turn 2 or 3 play yet. And I drew the worst card four past. It was like a one in eight, I think. Everybody seems to be playing the exact same deck today. Aw, oh, one turn too late, Mr. Negative. I don't think I have a winning play here. That's a good starting hand if I don't draw any more zero car zero power cards. Mm. So Bast is interesting. It adds plus four, five, six, seven, eight, nine minus five, so it is still plus four. I think I do it. If only to get it out of hand and draw more zero cost cards. And I may be playing against the bot.
drew null. So I still have Darkhawk, Iron Man, and Angela in the deck. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is a bot. At least that goes off before the... Jane Foster. This looks like a Galactus deck that didn't draw Galaxi Galactus. The bots do play Galactus decks. See, I have initiative, so Valkyrie doesn't really do much here. Go. Could play Valkyrie just as a three power card. Or a five power card, I mean. I think it might be a cheating bot. They look at my play and then calculate. Oh, I didn't realize Valkyrie sets herself to three power. Yep. Definitely a bot. Terrible draw. I can compete for Vibranium Mines because if he plays there, it buffs my Dark Hawk. Is there any way? I have initiative. Leader? I know he can't play to Vibranium Mines. He's gonna play multiple cards. He's gonna play like uh, Hulk and Death. And all he needs to do is play both of them to Atlantis and then I lose. If he only had one to play, I'd be fine.
Or are you going to play death and arrow or something? snapping I almost never fold to turn one snaps Interesting. Okay, got negative mighty Thor. Just don't draw Iron Man, I'll be in great shape. Okay, that's why he snapped. his enchantress. It's gonna be sad. I'm drawing Iron Man and Mystique here. Rip Bishop. I don't think Valkyrie is useful. It's going to be 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 16 there. Or would it be better to go like this? I think that's better. Okay. Sure. I don't think I have a Forge variant. Not that I play them a lot, but as long as I don't see a Pixel one, I'm happy. Yes, please. Very good Bast. Plus 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. It's a 115 in this spot. That's crazy powerful. If all these cards got played, which they won't be. Galactus. If it is, he's gonna Galactus to New York. Uh, 
Okay. The next card I draw is a leader. I don't know that I need to do anything here. Yes. Yeah, there's no way he was going to go to showdown there. Unless it was a bot. So I guess I should have snapped just in case. Alrighty, that seems like a good place to stop for now. Good solid 20 something cube gain, but most of it was against bots. But that's the ranked climb now. So, thank you for watching.